Jack's not here. I think this is the first time he's not here in a long time. No, tonight is filled with so many surprises. I'm so excited. Oh, I'm okay. <laughs> yeah. It's out of a lot right now. <laughs> I think there's a couple more people coming. for choosing to be here. Meditation Mount has been here for 51 years. Um, they're based in Creative Meditation and um, part of Creative Meditation mm. is sound meditation or sound baths. Um, what we do here is we try with the sound we use it to connect a little deeper inside within ourselves. Um, is this anyone's first time to Meditation Mount? Wow. Thanks for being here. Just FYI, the, the weather gets really nice in about like 30 minutes. <laughs> um, thank you for coming. Is this anyone's first sound experience? A couple? Yay. Oh good, welcome, thank you for, for this, yeah. So, um, the sound, as you can see, there's like many different instruments and a lot of the different instruments, they bring about certain emotions, thoughts, feelings, or, or, or ignite an imagination that's wonderful and creative and amazing. Mm -hmm. But it could also bring about things that maybe you're thinking about throughout your week, or stuff that you've worried about, or something deep within your past. If that does happen, I do invite you to place your hands on your heart, and just remember, you can open your eyes, take a few deep breaths, and just remember that you're in a safe space, that you are loved, and that you are loved. And then also ask for help from your guides to help you understand what it is that's coming up for you because it wants to be transformed. A little housekeeping, if you do have parasols and they make crunchy noises, don't worry, it happens. This will just be part of the sound. And if you haven't already, please place your phone on vibrate. We're a trinity of sound, and Deanna will be leading us in a meditation, and Kelly will be doing some breath work, and then we'll journey on. Yes. Did I forget anything? That was good. No. That's great. Okay. Good job. Good job. Awesome. Thank you, Karina. Good evening, everyone. Good, good evening. evening. That was okay. We're going to try it again. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Nice. I think we got one more good one in us. Good evening, everyone. Good, good evening. evening. Yes. Did y'all hear the beauty of those voices? Did y'all hear it? Oh, it was nice, nice, nice. So welcome to Meditation Mount. I am Deanna. And I know most of you are already, y'all are ready for the sound. Um, but if you don't mind, I do ask if you sit up um, just for a little bit because we're going to do a little bit of acknowledgement and... Uh, I would love to be able to see your eyes and just to connect with you, if that's okay. If you're just comfortable, you're like, I'm sorry, sister, I am here. <laughs> that is totally fine. Um, but if, if you have it in you to sit up, we would really, really love that. Because I get it. The earth is holding you, and you're mm -hmm. like, this feels good. And but So thank you so much. So one of the things that we love to do here before we start is just take a moment to connect eye to eye, heart to heart, soul to soul with everyone who is in the space. And today, this will be a part of our meditation because I really want us to take a moment to just take in each other, take in what's around us, just to really be able to connect, okay? So we'll start first and we're going to start to just look around and see who's in the space that also informs us of what to play, when to play it, how to play it. And it's just um, how we begin to seal and create this beautiful container of sound. Okay, so if you don't mind us staring into those beautiful <laughs> eyes, um, we know it's a very intimate thing. You can keep your glasses on, or you can take them off, whatever feels comfortable. Okay, so we'll start. Just taking a moment to acknowledge. Thank you for the smiles. 
the head knots. <laughs> and now we invite you all <clears throat> to take a few moments to look around you connecting with the people who are to the left of you to the right of you taking a moment to turn around and see who's behind you and if there's no one behind you just look at this beautiful scenery taking in the mountains the trees even the sun if you dare gaze into the sun um, but yeah just taking a moment to take in the immense beauty of those who are in the space with us throwing each other a smile. Yeah, waving nice. A heart, yeah. a yeah. nice little wave. <laughs> we don't want to leave the people in the back out, so can we all just wave yeah, the folks hey. in the back? And the folks in the way back, can y'all wave at us? Thank you, yeah. yes. Because we're all here together. Mm, and this is the only time, this is the only time that all of us will be together like this. We will never come back quite in this way again so with that in mind let's just take another moment to just look around and take in because this is the moment this is this moment we will never have it again wonderful that's nice wonderful <laughs> and our meditation has already begun so keeping in mind the sense of present, presencing this now moment. I invite you to close the outer eyes, beginning to bring your awareness to your breath. And we're still in the energy of this beautiful full moon that went direct Wednesday morning. And, you know, we often hear about full moons. It's about release, release. Let go of what no longer serves you. And I feel like that comes after the full moon, not on the day of the full moon. So I just want to create an opportunity for us to really acknowledge and take a moment to acknowledge all of the blessings and the generosity of the universe that we've experienced from the new moon to this full moon, that cycle. And I want you to think over just do a brief scan of what has evolved and emerged and manifested beautifully over this past moon cycle for you. What are some of the blessings and generosities of the universe that you've received? And just taking a moment to presence them in your mind's eye. And then I want you to find something else. That unfolded and blossomed for you. This last lunar cycle from the new moon to the full moon. really getting present to what it felt like to see and witness and experience the fulfillment of this particular thing or situation or relationship or opportunity, whatever it is. And once you have that feeling of gratitude and acknowledgement really present, I invite you to begin to feel that gratitude washing over and pouring over you. Thank you. 
extending that gratitude to yourself, being grateful to and for yourself for showing up for yourself. Can we just take a moment to relish in that space of self-gratitude? And if you can, I invite you to cup your hands, keeping the palms nice and open, but just cup your hands close to your heart, almost as if you're ready for someone or something to come by and place a beautiful gift in your hands. If there is anything that you could receive right now, what would it be? More patience, more understanding, more financial resources, more compassion, more laughter, more miracle moments, whatever that is. Imagine that your hands are open to receive even more generosity of spirit. And then once you feel like there's, your hands are filled, I invite you to slowly begin to cascade it over your body, almost like water. Just allow it to just cascade, bringing those hands over the head if you feel, or you can just keep it right here by the heart. Whatever feels good. allowing this sound experience to amplify and make space for in greater ways all that you would love to experience more of. So maintaining this space of gratitude and acknowledgement feeling the generous nature of the universe. We'll stay in this space as Kelly guides and directs us in breath work and vocal toning. So keeping your eyes closed and your heart open, we're going to be breathing in and out, a simple breath through the nose, but we're gonna be focusing on our heart center while we do it, so. When we inhale, the inhale expands the belly, so it goes out like a balloon. And when we exhale, the belly comes back towards the spine. Um, maybe place a hand over your heart and one on the earth. And just kind of feel into your body for a minute if you need to move from side to side while breathing kind of slowly. Just really feel into yourself. We're going to be settling into our body and noticing what comes up during this. So take a long, slow, deep inhale and keep your awareness on your heart center as you do that. And then exhale back down into the earth. So when we inhale, we're pulling the energy from the earth to our heart center. So inhale. And when we exhale, we're sending that energy from the heart center back down to the earth. So this is also a visualization. So long, slow, deep inhale, pulling the energy from the earth into your belly, then your heart center, holding it for a moment, and exhaling back down into the earth. Inhaling again from the earth, pulling it up into your belly, into your heart center, opening your heart center. Exhaling back down, into the earth and this can be a strong powerful breath through the nose you can feel it and hear it inhale from the earth into the heart center holding it exhaling and letting it go and giving it back down to the earth inhaling again long slow and this time even deeper opening the heart center 
exhaling back down into the earth and letting it all go on the exhale. Inhaling from the earth and pulling up the energy into your body and visualize it circulating into your heart center, opening your heart center and letting it all go back down into the earth with the exhale. Inhaling long, slow, and deep, pulling up the energy into your heart center. Visualize your heart center getting brighter and brighter green with each inhale and exhaling back down into the earth. Inhaling again from the earth and pulling that energy and almost seeing a pulsating green, vibrant light in your heart center. Exhaling back down into the earth and letting it go. Inhaling from the earth into your belly, into the heart, the brightest green you can possibly imagine. And then releasing everything that does not serve you with the exhale into the earth. Inhaling again, pulling up all of the love, all of the gratitude, all of the grace you can manage to handle in your body. Now letting go of everything that does not serve you on the exhale. Just push it out with the exhale. Inhaling again, all of those beautiful high energy emotions like gratitude and love and joy. Holding it in your heart and exhaling back down into the earth. Now taking a long, slow, deep inhale, holding it for a moment, and your entire exhale is going to be a hum, sounding like this, hum. And then when you're ready, inhale again, Continue with the hums on the exhale. Hum. Humming unblocks the throat chakra. It helps move stagnant energy. So if it feels tight in your throat, if you feel like you need to cough, if you feel like you're choking, All of these things are normal and be gentle with yourself, but don't be afraid to push with the humming. vibration that you're creating from the humming and see if you can sense your energetic body vibrating builds up behind your lips, open up into a ma.
together. Take a nice long deep inhale and hold it at the top, becoming totally present and still in this moment and noticing what it feels like to be you right now. And exhale and let it all go. And staying in the same energetic space, keeping your eyes closed if possible, make your way down to a Shavasana if that feels right, laying on your back or you can stay seated, whatever feels comfortable. Noticing all of the places that the earth is supporting you. Feeling all the connections. Noticing where your body feels the most tense. And noticing where your body feels the most relaxed. And breathing into all of those places. it becomes a little intense or you feel some difficult emotions arising, you can always open your eyes and look at the beauty all around you. Or try focusing on the birds also. That's really enjoyable. So relaxing your face and your head, relaxing your jaw and your hair, Relaxing your heart, your stomach, your shoulders, relaxing your hips and your legs, your knees and your ankles, relaxing your feet and all of your toes, relaxing the space between your toes. Relaxing your hands and your fingers, and relaxing the space between your fingers. Relaxing the space around your body, and completely letting go.
shine your light, shine your light like the sun.
allowing the sweetness of that mantra to continue to resonate and wash over you, Rama Dasa, say so hum. Feeling into that vibrational resonance as you slowly begin to wiggle your fingers and your toes, bringing that beautiful, buoyant, brilliant spirit and your awareness and consciousness back into that glorious body temple bringing some movement into the body temple, being gentle with yourself, not rushing, stretching out the arms and legs, rotating the ankles and the wrist, coming back to earth while feeling yourself still connected to the infinity that you are that extends beyond this body that dances with the stars and the moon and the sun, that skyrockets through the clouds, that part of you that knows no boundaries. Slowly beginning to, if you're still lying down, go ahead and come to either your left or right side into a fetal position, being ever so sweet and gentle as you begin to emerge from this experience. Treating yourself as you would a newborn baby. Gentle, sweet, kind, loving, thoughtful. And slowly begin to look around you, seeing what has shifted, what is changed what's the same noticing your own energetic fields and bodies do you feel lighter do you feel brighter do you feel sleepy <laughs> ah, so inviting everyone to go ahead and extend those arms towards the heavens like tree branches, really stretching out the spine. Beautiful and allowing them to slowly cascade down to your side. Really taking time to see if you can feel and catch a piece of your energetic self. Like, oop, I feel a little tingle. And then I invite you to do that one more time. Extend the arms up, reach, reach, reach. And then we're gonna bring them down in front of us, but this time we're gonna stop at heart level. And then we're gonna extend them out to the sides to get a real nice, good heart opener. Yes, and then we're gonna go ahead and bring those arms around ourselves and give ourselves a nice, tight, fat, juicy so squeeze. <laughs> Love on yourself, hug yourself, adorn yourself, whisper sweet nothings. Sweet everything's to yourself. Open those arms up one more time, getting a good heart stretch. Opening up the heart. Mm. Letting your heart be the sun. And then closing those arms right back around yourself. Another tight squeeze. This time, maybe kiss your shoulders. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Rub and caress yourself. Maybe give yourself a, oh, baby, I love you. Oh, baby, I love mm -hmm. you. And we're going to do that one more time. Open up those arms. Nice. I mean, I want that, that chest out like you are the sun. Give it to us. Yes. And then if you came with someone, I invite you to turn towards them and give them a hug. And if you came by yourself, go ahead and give yourself another tight squeeze. That's nice. <laughs> And they got one more hug. Go ahead and open those arms one more time. And this time we're going to hug Gaia, Pachamama, Mother Earth. Imagine yourself hugging her, giving her some love. Yes, I see someone just laid out on the ground like, here you go, Mama. Just go ahead and give Mama that love. <sighs> Thank you all so much for joining us this Friday evening. You could have been anywhere in town, anywhere in Southern California, anywhere in the, on the planet, really, and yet you chose to be here. And we just want to say thank you so much for leaving your imprint, for just bringing your full self here tonight. We hope that you feel a little lighter 
a little brighter, a little bit more hopeful. And we pray that you have a beautiful weekend, a beautiful night, and we look forward to seeing you all again on the Mount sometime soon. We love you. Have a beautiful weekend and continue to shine your light like the sun. Mm -hmm. Thank you.